And then we've got the four babies who have come out. We've got AC1, AC2, this one's Amy's. She picked her out, or him or her, out as an egg, my sister. Uh, AC3, AC4. All of them uh, have hatched pure black... Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, pure black with just a teeny, teeny, tiny bit of white on the chin, which... Hi. Aren't you curious? Hi. Oh. Come here. So small. Um, which they inherited from their dad. I expected the little bit of white on the chin from all of them. Um, the tiny bit of white markings, they're actually gray, will turn uh, black within the next two weeks. I'm not quite sure why they hatch. Oh my gosh, you're so cute. With uh, white markings, but, you know, look how cute. I love babies. But this is AC4. This is the most recent one that hatched. Um, I want, I wish I could take a group picture, but I'm not risking mixing them up because, uh, my sister, you know, picked one out and I don't want to get them mixed up. Plus, it's better for my records to keep them separate, so yeah. And they're on a heat pad right next to their mama and their mom's upgraded cages. Not quite in the mill yet because, um making time, construction time, whatever. But we've got AC4 right there. Um, sexes won't be confirmed until they've had their first shed and preferably their first meal as well, just to give them a little time before I start squishing them. That's a bad description of it, but before I start messing with them enough to tell their sexes. We'll show AC3 next. AC4 and AC3 are um, technically unclaimed. I'm hoping that AC1, that I have enough males and females uh, to where AC1 can go to the person I want them to go to. So this is AC3. And, um, oh, you're so cute. The AC comes from the parentage. Aurelian and Cassiopeia, it's just for my records. Um, all the babies in the future will also be called, oh goodness, you're wiggly, aren't you? Will be called AC as well, just further along, just for the records. But if I can get your chin in a thing, this one also has a teeny bit of white, it's hard to see, on the chin. But they all do, and it'll be gone within two weeks. I'm excited to see the sexes of these guys. Oh, I'm sorry. I know. I'm a big scary. I'm a big scary. Um, these are just their hatchling cages. I'm actually going... I'm only keeping them in these to make sure they eat well. And then after they have one or two meals, they'll be moved on to something larger. Uh, I don't have the large cages yet. It's the guy who gave me Aurelian Cassiopeia who has the cages. But this is AC2, which is my sister's. Oh, my camera's trying to fall apart again. This is my old camera because my other camera is terrible at video. Hi, little one. So this is my sister's. AC2. And this one has a little bit less white on the chin than most of them. <laughs> Stop moving! I just want to take a video! This one's always been a little more wiggly, but I'm sure she'll come down. He or she. I've been referring to this one as a she for no good reason. Hi! Yeah, you're a wiggle, aren't ya? Other than that's just what I started deferring, referring to them as Oh my goodness, you're such a wiggle. Um, I'd laugh if it did turn out to be a female. It'd be kind of hilarious. And then we've got AC1. These are all, they're so freaking cute. I love babies.
and the cages are really moist right now just because I expect them to shed within a couple days. Um, so I'm keeping it moist and then they'll be moved to Aspen. I was actually kind of worried for a second there that uh, this one was missing even though it's physically impossible for him to escape. This is the very first one to both pip and hatch. This one was the closest to the um, the heat device, but look, you can see the belly. That's the belly. Pure black. I'm super happy with how these guys came out. I'm used to seeing baby Mexican blacks that are banded with white. Um, and they always turn out black in the end. This one actually has the second to least amount of white markings. I'm not sure why, but um, I see a lot of hatchlings that have white banding, which is okay because they all turn out black anyways, but I'm actually really super stoked that these guys came out black with no white other than the chins. I'm hoping the rest of them are that way as well. <laughs> yeah, that this was just a random video that I made because I can and babies are the best. Yeah.